Very pleased to say that Marcus Tarn is with us now, co-founder of Carousel, and still with us is our guest host, Kelvin Tay of UBS Global Wealth Management. Marcus, let's start with you, and, and welcome. Great to see you. Luxury resale, how is that going to work for Carousel? Because the challenge, of course, I'm uh, very interested to hear what you say about authentication. The challenge is there is no shortage of dodgy Gucci, Pucci, and Fiorucci <laughs> on the market, isn't there? Exactly. So, firstly, Carousel mission is to make secondhand the first choice, and luxury is one of our largest category on platform. And because of that, we know the user pain points when it comes to the category. So, mainly like what you shared, super fix, right? How do you know if that is real? And also, second thing they also wanted to always give us feedback on is the convenience to transact and buy. And thirdly, is the brightest variety. Super fix. That's how you define it. So, it's getting harder to. Yeah determine the provenance and determine what is fake and what is counter, what is legitimate. Exactly. Some of these products are super real, in a sense. So we introduced two programs um, to, to, to tackle this over 2023. So the first one is certified luxury. So where we authenticate um, the bags, making sure it, it's real. So we have an in-house a team that has tens of years of experience in um, luxury products. So they work in those brands before to authenticate. The second thing we do is that we sell to us carousel program, where when they are selling, we actually check before it actually comes onto the platform. Can and we, the third thing, yeah. last one, is that if you buy it and you realize it's fake, you can actually can return it with our oh, return policy. That's yeah. good to know. I'm just wondering, is there, yeah, so, so is there any potential for recourse? Let's say if you buy something and it's, it was certified real and it turns out to be a, a, a fake itself, and how do you actually uh, uh, implement this path of recourse as well for your buyers? Yeah, so there are two things. So the first one is that we have a 24 hours a change of mind policy. So for example, if you buy the item, you're not, you don't really like it, you can actually return it within 24 hours. Of course, uh, there's some terms and conditions, like the tech has to be still there. The second one is that if you buy the product and you realize it's fake, you can actually return it uh, to, 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 to Carousel, to us. Interesting. Interesting. And how is this going to uh, drive uh, the revenue stream? And is this, is, this a, uh, is this something that you can roll out and plug into other markets in Southeast Asia? So the first thing, uh, so definitely, uh, to answer your question directly, uh, for us, our goal is to become the largest managed marketplace for resale luxury products. And one of the key things that when we ask our users over the years, what are the key pain points? They always share the three same things like trust, convenience, and I would like more variety and options to, sell, to buy the products. So we introduced a certified luxury program. Uh, we also did sell to carousel program to, get, to have all these supply. And thirdly, with this announcement that we had, we actually wanted to partner Lux Lexicon to power this certified luxury. I realized we have similar uh, vision on what the luxury market should be, which is uh, authenticated, real, good variety. I realized it's better to partner and come together and partner. And you know, individually we are great, but together we are so much better to actually tackle and grow this uh, luxury uh, market. In what, do you think the size, yeah, what do you think is the size of this luxury, second-hand luxury market, actually? Yeah. So when we did, uh, we did research on our own, um, uh, we've also commissioned like, a third party to do that. It's, it is poised to be at 7.5 billion uh, by 2026. Wow. So the huge opportunity, mainly for the users, they like the customers, right? Like I shared, fakes are super common. So how can we help them provide a great experience of not getting a fake product? Um, which is why we partner with like, Saxicon as well, because they have a retail shop in uh, Orchard Road where they can actually go down and take a look and check uh, before they purchasing it, before they purchase it, so they have uh, ease of mind and assurance when buying the product. So